All right, hello, this is Dinoshi Masella from the CCR team. I'm here doing an interview with the University of Nevada, Reno. Um, just to start off, could you give me a little description about your university? Yeah, so we're a four-year public university. We're located in Reno, Nevada. We have over 140 different majors for students to choose from. And the nice part about our university is that none of our majors are impacted, meaning they can get in, get out, graduate in four years, and go on to move uh, to the career or job of their choice. Okay, so what's one thing that you love about the school that you're, you're representing? One thing I really like about my school is just about like how much school spirit there is for the university, and you see it everywhere. So everyone drives around, they have UNR stickers, everyone talks about the Wolfpack, you get student discounts all over the city, and it's just a really nice that the city of Reno embraces and appreciates the university so much. So what would you say sets you apart from other schools? What, make, what makes you special? What makes us special? So we're a tier one university, meaning that out of the top 4,000 colleges and universities in the United States, we're in the top 5%. That's one thing. We're also an R1 Carnegie Research Institution, meaning that we're in the top 130 universities, uh, 130 universities in the nation for research and student involvement and undergraduate and research and the master's and PhDs level as well. And just, um, I would say, how much of those opportunities we have for undergraduates is really important as well. Okay, so regarding the application process, what's some key advice you would give to freshman applicants coming out of high school applying to your uh, college? Um, some key advice I would give is apply as early as possible. The earlier you apply, um, the first access you have to different scholarships, housing, and really just get it off your mind. It's the one less thing to worry about because as you get closer to the end of senior year, more projects will pick up. So get it done early and make sure that you have first access to all those different opportunities. Okay. Um, are there any programs that provide additional assistance for undocumented uh, students coming into the uh, university? Yes, so we have something called institutional methodology. So certain, uh, um, certain undocumented students uh, can apply to FAFSA. And so what our university has, it has specific scholarships and different financial aid available to those students. They just have to go to UNR financial aid, um, apply to institutional methodology, and then we can offer financial aid for those students so they can also afford an education. Okay, so um, regarding scholarships, like you mentioned before, do you have merit-based scholarships like for students coming in based on GPA or SAT or any uh, academics or extracurriculars that you could uh, apply scholarships for? Yes, so we have a scholarship matrix. Also, if you just Google UNR financial aid, you can find out all about it. It tells you exactly which GPA and which test score would be required for merit-based scholarships and exactly what that amount would be. We also have college scholarships available at the undergraduate level, uh, available depending on which major you choose. And then also any kind of uh, need-based scholarships are also available through the university based on your FAFSA information. So regarding life on campus, how is what is uh, like how is the surrounding city? How is Reno? How is the college and like its environment like around the campus for student uh, life? So Reno, like I was saying earlier, is really a tier is an awesome college town. There's lots of opportunities for them to do, or whether it be downtown, midtown. We also have Lake Tahoe, 45 minutes away, and because we have so many different opportunities for students to have fun outside of campus, it's become a real central hub, and the city really does focus around the university itself. So what is the tuition for this uh, university, for uh, students getting knowledge, just like straight tuition? So tuition is $22,000 for out-of-state. If students who are from California qualify for a program called WUI, it's the Western Undergraduate Exchange, their tuition can be dropped down to around $10,500 a year. That's less than the average UC, which is $14,000 a year, and less than some of the CSUs. And that's why over a third, about a third of our university comes from California. All right, thank you for your time.